Early last century, water planners invested in vast infrastructure that allowed people to rapidly settle the desert southwest. Today, demand has exceeded supply, with 40 million people depending on the Lower Colorado River. The U.S. Bureau of Reclamation conducted a comprehensive analysis of supply and demand to minimize impacts of less water supply that could emerge years and decades from now. So the Bureau of Reclamation and the Basin States initiated a two to three year study looking at the climate vulnerabilities in the Colorado Basin. They had developed a series of demand projections of future um, hydrologic conditions. They realized that the, the traditional planning tools that they would have normally relied on really weren't gonna work in that situation where we had tens of thousands of different scenarios. Those scenarios included climate change, demand, management, law, and the flow of water. We don't know how the future is going to evolve, but we have computing power, we have new tools that can really help us do massive what-if experiments to understand what the future could look like. Then we can test our decisions to find those that are robust or insensitive to that wide range of uncertainty. The new analysis shed light on a crucial vulnerability. Many scenarios showed water levels in Lake Mead could fall below critical thresholds in coming years. With 90% of their water supply at risk, the Southern Nevada Water Authority needed a long-term solution. So the utility drilled a three-mile tunnel to access deeper, higher quality water further from the shore. The new intake and a planned pumping station were designed to provide water even in the face of continued stress on water supplies. This third pumping station needs to last 80 to 100 years. With these billion dollar projects, it's, it's extremely important, unless you want to go back and do it over again, to design the project correctly for the climate variables that you're going to face in the future. No one can predict the future, but the realistic supply and demand scenarios in the Basin Study are helping planners such as the Southern Nevada Water Authority make billion dollar decisions with more confidence.